Right guys, got a couple of packages. This one's from Blade Ops and this one's Amazon. It's another one of these, which I think are really cool little little knives. Perfect to have on your desk. A little um, friction folder. Really nicely made. D2 steel. 12 bucks. <laughs> anyway, quality control on this one. Perfect centering, smooth as silk. Look at that. These things are really wonderful little knives. I like them a lot. Anyway, let's get that one out of the way and uh, get on and open up our knife from Blade Ops. Let's see what we've got. We've got a nice a tops knife. I've never had a tops knife before, but I do like tactical knives, and uh, I love my fixed blades. And as it's Friday, fixed blade Friday, uh, I figured we'd open this one up and take a look at it. 101% made in the USA. That's pretty. That's pretty good. 101%. That's my kind of math. Um, Top's mission to create the highest quality, rugged, unique, overbuilt and functional tools for service members and outdoorsmen of all kinds through our superior manufacturing, finishing process and genuine field operators testing. Alright, well that all sounds good. Uh, no warranty stuff. One life, one knife. Tactical Division, Tools for the Professional, Military, Law Enforcement and Survival Experts. So if that's your thing, this is what we got. We got the CAT 200 HP BLM. So let's take a look at it. But first I want to see what else we got in here. Because these guys look after me at Blade Ops, send me some cool stickers and stuff. Quality innovative custom knives. That looks good. Check them out. Whoop, I don't want to dox myself. Um, Benchmade USA. Cool sticker. CRKT. I've got quite a few CRKT knives. And what we got here? Oh, here we've got a SOG authorised dealer sticker. That's pretty cool. So thanks. Blade Ops guys for that. Uh, yeah, cool guys. Let's take a look at this. One of the reasons why I love dealing with Blade Ops, I mean, they're super fast shipping. They've been perfect every time. And uh, look at this. This is the price of the knife. Of the Tops Cat 200. Right, just under 90 bucks. No shipping fee. No tax. You pay the price that you see online, and I love that. There's not too many places that do that these days. And if you're in California, not having to pay extra California tax is a real big bonus. So anyway, this is my first Tops knives. So pretty cool, cool box that they come in. Yeah, check them out. 101% made in the USA. Nicely sealed. It's a seal to keep moisture out. I think this knife is 10.95 if I remember rightly. Let's see what you get. Can feeding your new tops knife. Uh, it's about the cleaning and uh, how to look after it there. Freeze that and look after that if you want. Certificate of manufacture and auth authenticity. That looks like a whistle on there. Is that a whistle? 
Sure looks like it. Hang on. Yep, that's a whistle. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Emergency whistle there. Heavy duty spring clip. This clip is designed to rotate slowly until your desired position is achieved. Do not lubricate o-ring. This clip has been assembled using threadlock and is not intended to be removed or adjusted. Removing clip will void on your manufacturer's warranty. Okay. Uh, yeah, so this clip, oh yeah, it's pretty stiff, which is good. It's what you want. Um, yeah, great clip there, because I plan on carrying this horizontal carry. Uh, I like that style, but of course you carry it vertical, upside, you carry it upside down, horizontal, vertical, tilted to one side or the other. Any which way you want. This gives you 360 degrees of choice, which is fantastic. And these knives are used by law enforcement and uh, military and the likes. Nice Kydex sheath there. Holds it in really nicely. Yeah, I like that. Cool bit of kit. There we go. All right, so I mean, you could carry this in a whole ton of different different me methods. You know, left hand, right hand. I mean, for, fr for front carry, it's set up here for right hand, but just move the clip on the other side, set it up for left hand. Uh, very versatile. All right, so what does CAT stand for? C-A-T. That stands for Covert Anti-Terrorism. And it's used by military and law enforcement and campers, hunters, Joe Public like me. And um, it's got this black coating on the 1095 steel, so it's low maintenance. And the blade length is 3.25 inches, and the overall length is 7.25 inches, and the blade thickness is 0 0.16 inches. And it's um, the black finish, they call it black traction. The handle length is 4 inches and the handle material is G10 and it weighs 5.6 ounces and uh, the sheath weighs 2.2 ounces, the Kydex sheath. Now I've got big hands, XL hands and my fingers just drop into these grooves, absolutely perfect. Heavy jimp in here on the thumb. You go forward if you want to. It's a nice sharpening choil there. Not so sure what these are for, but they're they're in them. I'm thinking if you've got something I don't know that you need to twist or something, you could pop it in there, and that would give you a really good twisting purchase or um, holes. Holes are always handy, aren't they? For I don't know, any kind of survival -y type things. But uh, leave it to your imagination what they're, what they're for. If you know, if you know any more than me, I mean, I've just got the thing, but dr drop in the comments what these are for. I like the... It's a stabby tool. This is a stabby tool. Look at them, the swedging here. And there's a real, a real sharp blade there. All right, I said the word sharp, so we gotta we gotta do the cut test. <laughs> I don't have much paper lying around. Here's a little bit of paper that will. Uh, yeah, this is like super sharp, super sharp. Look at that curly little cut there. Yeah, so amazingly sharp. There's a bit of jimping on the back there too, in a lanyard hole. Looks like it's brass lined. They do different handle types as well. 
and but I, I like the black and grey. Black and grey looks good. All different. Uh, yeah, this is a this is a tool. <laughs> So anyway, there you go. I like my fixed blades. So this is Friday, fixed blade Friday. Who did I hear say that? I think it might have been Paddy Potato Peelings. I think he said that the other week and it's stuck in my brain. But uh, anyway, let's see how this sticks in the Kydex. Punk. That's in there rock solid. That's not, it's not falling out anywhere. You can carry this upside down on your backpack or whatever. Like I say, I, I like cross draw. And I like to have my cross draw up front and then hidden under my belly. Uh, it's one handy thing for bellies. You can hide stuff under like this. <laughs> I mean, you, you could carry it cross draw across your back or whatever. Kidney carry, all that good stuff. It's one of the better Kydex sheaths that I've seen in a long time. Yeah, really useful. Alright, that's it. Just a quickie for today. It's a, yeah, great knife. I'm really happy with it. Good price for a quality bit of kit. I could save your bacon one day. You never know. Alright, thanks for watching guys. We'll catch you later. And check out Blade Ops. Uh, yeah, you could do yourself a favour by checking them out. They're, they're a good good company. I buy a lot of lot of knives from those guys these days. That's where I get all my uh, Kalashnikov uh, switch blades from. Yeah, cool. Oh yeah, don't forget the whistle. Tops knives, spec ops, trust tops knives.com. Catch you later, guys.